We found you in Thailand, said my dad. He's telling the truth, said Steve. I frowned. That was a strange way for my dad to phrase it. He said found instead of adopt, but I shook it off and continued with the next question. How did my biological parents die? I asked. There was a slight pause. My parents seemed to be thinking of a response. In a car crash. It was a terrible thing, they said. Steve looked up at them, then at me. His eyes were widened in shock. They're lying. I looked at my parents in disbelief. What? No, no, that can't be right, said Mom. This thing must be rigged. I can assure you it's not, said Steve. Are my real parents even dead? I asked. Yes, they are, Tom. Why would we lie about something like that? Steve sounded defeated as he said, You're lying. Again. I turned on my parents in fury. I can't believe you would lie to me, I yelled. We're not down. out of the room, rushing out the door and back into our car. I didn't even want to complete the lie detector test. I was too livid over what my parents had done. My parents said the device must be faulty, but I had a feeling it was reliable. So that meant my biological parents weren't dead. But why would my parents lie to me about that? Plenty of adoptive kids had biological parents who were alive and living somewhere. Even if I had biological parents who were alive, that didn't mean I didn't love my adoptive parents. It was so strange of them to hide this secret from me. A few minutes later, my parents got into the car and we drove back to our temporary home. 